Hello everyone and welcome to a different little video. Uh, this is going to be a little bit of a story time. I'm going to tell you about when I went and got a chip in my hand. So here's the only pick I could find uh, from this event. Um, this is uh, an, actually an Instagram pick from my Instagram page. Um, So basically, um, we went to uh, France with uh, the company I work for, and you know we were supposed to have some sort of conference and play some tennis and uh, you know things like that, teamwork, team building things. And uh, as we arrived in France, they told us they had been having this uh, secret guest. Um, coming with us the entire time and there was this guy during the trip that uh, you know I talked to on the bus and on the plane and he said uh, he was a new employee um, at our company but he wasn't he was actually a secret guest and he was like uh, a person that uh, uh, works at some cyborg chip microchip company um, and then uh, when we arrived in France, they told us that uh, you can either follow this guy to um, this conference room and get a chip in your hand, or you can go play tennis. And uh, I thought it would be a lot more fun to get a chip in, in my hand rather than playing tennis. So I actually went and got chipped. Uh, I don't know if you can see it in the camera here, but here's my chip. Uh, if I touch it, it sort of moves. It's a really bad camera here. Um, uh, the reason why I didn't record this using my good camera is because I wanted to show you this picture as well um, while I was recording. Because then I wouldn't need to use a recording software afterwards and put the pic on the video. But anyway, uh, we got this uh, chip in our hands, um, the people who want it, of course. And we got it all for free, um, so it's pretty cool. Now, my first thought was actually that I didn't know what I was going to use this chip for. Mm, because it's like, uh, what is it called? Um, RFI chip? No, what is called? Uh, I think it's called RFID chip. NFC chip. Maybe it's called NFC chip. Uh, let me check on my phone here. Uh, yeah, it's an NFC chip. Um, I think it's called or RFID. RFID or something like that. Um, anyway, I think it has like 868 bytes of storage or something. And you can put your uh, bus card on it. Uh, you can put your gym card on it. And uh, so then you would just, if, let's say I put my bus card in here, then I would just uh, like touch this, touch my hand on the uh, bus card reader on the bus and it would blip. And uh, yeah. Now, Personally, I haven't actually put anything on here. I think uh, there's just a link to uh, somewhere on it. I actually think I put a link to my YouTube channel on it, if I remember correctly. By uh, default, they had a link to the chip company. Um, so I think I changed that, if I remember correctly. But yeah, in this picture, you can see me... Uh, I think this was... Maybe the day after I got the chip, maybe. Uh, and we were hanging out by the pool. Um, so when I actually got the chip, I remember, uh, like most of us actually got a little bit, little bit dizzy after we got the chip in our hand. I don't know why that is. Might be just, uh, you know, the body reacting to, um, you know, getting a, uh, a foreign material into your, uh, flesh 
Maybe it's just some sort of shock response or something. I don't know. But a lot of people got dizzy. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I have no plans for this ship. Actually, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Because um, right now, I would actually like to have my credit card on it. But that's not possible at the moment. Um, maybe it's going to be possible in the future. But as of now, it's actually not possible. Um, but yeah, I think it's a really cool thing that the uh, the company gave us this uh, uh, opportunity to get a chip in your head. So I am officially a cyborg, <laughs> or I've been a cyborg for like, uh, I don't know, maybe it was one and a half year ago that we did this. I don't actually remember. Um, but yeah. So that's pretty cool. What else is there to say about this? I just wanted to share with you this story. I don't know if I told you a lot about it. I might have mentioned it, mentioned it in, some, in some video, but uh, I haven't actually told you the full story. And it's actually getting a lot more popular with getting microchips in your hand. Uh, I, I see it on LinkedIn all the time. But uh, yeah, unfortunately this was the only pic I could find. I know I've seen other pictures uh, actually of me sitting at the table and getting this chip injected. They basically had this sort of, uh, what, is it, what, what is it called in English? I have to translate the word. Uh, one moment, please. Um, they had this uh, syringe or this uh, injection shot thing. Um, where the ship was in so they just uh, first he just first uh, cleaned the hand here with some alcohol I think but then he put this syringe injection thing and just uh, inserted the chip and at first the chip was a lot more movable like I could actually move it around under the skin but I think now it has sort of grown into the flesh somehow I don't know if I remember correctly actually the the casing of the chip actually has uh, some sort of special plastic or glass kind of thing that is supposed to not, like the body is supposed to kind of reject it and don't uh, make it grow into the flesh. But I don't know, I, I feel like it has gotten more stable, like it. I can't move it a lot. I can't move it more, I could move it more previously when I first got it. So I don't know. Um, but yeah, I have an NFC reader on my phone. Uh, so I can actually like uh, scan the uh, the uh, the ship with my phone. Let's actually, see. oh, I've, I haven't downloaded the app. Uh, let's actually see if I can show it to, I'm just gonna download the app here again. Um, oh, I actually have the app. So it says approach an NFC tag. So let's see if it works. I know it's <clears throat> sometimes it's difficult to get the connection to the ship actually, but we're, we're gonna see here uh, if it still works. <laughs> Maybe it. Also, I think the NFC reader on my phone is actually a bit bad, but uh, there we go. It says NFC tag detected. And uh, now I got a bunch of options here. Uh, data, record, record, uh, task. Oh, I actually set it to open up uh, um, to open up Google Maps if I if it encounters it. But I think I have to close the app first, and then if I do this, let's see if we can detect it again. It should actually open Google Maps. I think if everything works. Uh, Uh, 
Let's just see here. Might not get it to work. There we go. Uh, so. Oh, it, to it tells me to install another app. Just wait a moment. It wanted me to install um, some task app. I guess I have to use that app to be able to parse it or something. So now I'm back at the home screen. Let's try and detect it again. <laughs> yeah, this is very clunky. It's come on. Come on. There we go. Chip detected. So that's actually what I have put on it. It opens Google Maps. <laughs> now, obviously, it would be faster to just click on the Google Maps uh, app in my phone rather than doing this all the time because it takes some time for it to actually detect my ship, you know. But yeah. Um, not a very long story, but I just wanted to tell you this because it's pretty interesting, I think. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.